Hi, I'm Agent Williams. Ready to get started with your Nintendo Switch? Agents like me set this up for people all the time. Here's how we do it. Let's start with what comes in the box. The Switch, of course, a dock, two Joy-Con controllers, controller straps, an AC adapter, an HDMI cable, a grip dock for the controllers, but you don't need it for the setup. What's not included? Your TV. You'll need it. If your Switch is in the dock, take it out now. Hot tip, I always keep the dock and cords nearby, but don't plug anything in yet. That part comes later. Turn the switch on. These are the Joy-Con controllers. If they aren't connected, slide them into the side of the switch now. Select your preferred language. Then, choose Americas or whatever continent you're on. Review the license agreement. If you agree, Check the accept box and tap next. The switch will search for Wi-Fi networks. When it finds yours, select it. Enter your password and tap OK. Your switch will now connect to the internet. This is also a good time to shake out those hands. Maybe even do some finger burpees. OK, it's done. Set your time zone. Now, let's connect the switch to your TV. Tap connect. You'll need the controllers. Take them out by pressing the button on the back of each one, then sliding upward. Slide the wrist straps into the grooves on each controller. Safety first. Hot tip. I always stand the switch up for the next few steps by flipping this out of the back. Time to practice using the controllers. Follow the on-screen directions to use the left joystick to navigate to next, then tap A on the right controller. Gather the dock, HDMI cable, and power cord. Got them? Select next on the switch. Flip the door on the back of the dock down, then plug in the cords. Their spots are marked. Connect the HDMI cord to your TV and power cord to the wall. Confirm on the screen as you go. Next, it's time to slide the switch into the dock. Go for it. Setup will continue on the TV. So double check the TV is on the right HDMI input. Then look at your TV. If you see this screen, you're good to go. Use the controllers to choose success. Now, the fun part. Let's add users. Every user on your Switch should get their own. I'm going to create a new user. It'll ask you to pick an image from a list of icons or make a me. It's fun to make a me because it can look like you. Notice the resemblance? Enter a nickname. Use your name, nickname, whatever. Then select Done. The next few screens will let you make more adjustments, like poses, facial expressions, and background color. Then confirm you want to add the user to the console. Next, you can log into your Nintendo account or decide to do it later. I'm gonna wait. You can add more users now if you want. Here you'll be asked if you want to learn more about Nintendo Online. Take a sec or move on. If you're a parent, this one's for you. You can set parental controls to limit playing time, purchases, and restrict content. No kids here, so I'm gonna skip. That's it, you're done. If you run into issues, ask a question in the comments below. We left some helpful links for you too, including one to set up an appointment with a Geek Squad agent. Before you go, Give this video a like and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips from Best Buy. Now, I have some aliens to hunt down. Oh.